स्टूडेंट इन माई न्यू टूटोरियल एंड टूडे आई बी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू अबाउट नेस्टेड इफ स्टेटमेंट दैट मीन्स इफ इन साइड एन अदर इफ सो डायरेक्टली आई एल टेक यू टूवर्ड्स अ न्यू फाइल क्लिकिंग ऑन फाइल एंड न्यू फाइल एंड नाउ आई मीन दिस इंटरफेस वेर आई मेक माई प्रोग्राम सो फर्स्टली आई एल यूज द प्रिंट कमांड using nested if statement program which is using nested if statement now the topic of the program actually i want to make a program in which i can use nested if a program to check if a student is selected for college or not so if we have to enroll a student for the college then there are certain conditions for that to check that conditions we can use nested if so firstly i should explain you about that condition which i want to use here i want to firstly take the name of the student and for that i want to use name variable name that means variable name is equal to input enter the name of the student so my program will ask the name of the student then i want to ask the age of a student for that i am taking age variable and that i'll be taking as a integer enter the age of the student double brackets here i have to actually close two times because two times i have started the bracket so it should be very particular and you have to be very cautious regarding all these things now i want to enter the marks and for that i am using marks variable and for the marks i am using as flow data type and why i am taking flow data type because marks can be in like points also like 97.5 86.4 like this and for that i am taking flow data type i am not taking as integer because integer will not support points that means marks in points float input now two time i have to close okay now what can be the certain conditions here firstly i'll explain you about the conditions the student should be enrolled in the college only if his age is more than 18 and second condition if his marks are more than 65 percentage okay otherwise is not eligible so for doing this i'll start with the if statement so firstly i'll ask if age greater than 18 after this double quotes then what should happen if age is greater than 18 then second question i'll ask now automatically when we are using if command and after double quotes if we are entering insertion point the insertion point comes little forward it is little bit right aligned so here i'll start with another if if marks that means my another variable is greater than 65 again double quotes then what it should do then i'll print that both the conditions are okay then the student is eligible for the college so i can print here firstly the variable name i'll use comma in what it commas is selected for the college 
if his marks is not greater than 65 then what it should do then in that case student should not be selected so i have to use else command and for using the else command because my insertion point is here i have to take my insertion point this side so i can use the backspace key also because it should be properly aligned here it should be aligned in this way okay always remember that whenever we have to use if command alignment plays a very important role so here i'll use else again double quotes and here i'll print now if both the conditions are working properly now i'll come back to the main condition now this is the main condition here this if is the main condition now i want to use one else here under this here because if age is greater than 18 then it's going inside this if and this else but what happens if age is not greater than 18 then it should go towards else so that only i'll be explaining so here i'll write else double quotes and then i want to print name inverted commas is too young for the college so my program is finished firstly i'll save this program desktop students click on save now i'll press f5 function key to check whether my program is working or not i'll press f5 enter the name of the student suppose i am pressing abc enter the age of the student firstly i am entering suppose 23 enter the marks of the student suppose 70 so abc is selected for the college means this is working properly i'll check again with the program second criteria i'll try to check again f5 key enter the name of the student suppose triple b and now i want to enter the age little less suppose uh, 13 mark suppose 80 so triple b is too young for the college that means this condition is also working properly and now again i'll press f5 function key enter the name of the student suppose triple c age of the student i am entering suppose more now and enter the marks of the student marks this time i am putting less so that condition also i can check so triple c is not selected for the college and why is not selected because the marks are less that means my all the conditions are working properly so that means our program is okay so with this i'll close my tutorial just try this and if you like my explanation then please do like share and comment and also subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed it earlier okay take care bye bye meet you soon in my next tutorial